Blended Learning PLC, using the work of Catlin Tucker and blended learning models to close gaps and improve outcomes for students. Rebecca Weinkoop, Courtney Nossman, Deanna Romero, Dahlia Martinez, Brooke George, Sue Ann Kaufman, and Matina Fresenius. Classes targeted for station rotation were intended to get an accurate assessment of a cross section of all students at Eagle Staff, blended in co taught social studies, ELL and Proyecto Saber, co taught LA and HCC. At the start of this school year, we implemented station rotations into our classrooms with different lessons. And in December, we asked students to fill out a survey and tell us what they thought about the stations. As you can see, based on our survey results, overall students felt that they knew what they were doing and saw station rotations as helpful to their learning. As teachers, we found it was really helpful for us to get more one-on-one -on -one and small group time with students. We also were able to listen for formative assessment and hear authentic student conversations. Some students felt that they were struggling with the timing of rotations and that was also on teacher end of trying to create lessons that were long enough for each station, but also short enough for each station. But students felt they could transition well, that they understood and could work independently, and that they were learning. We also saw a lot of students work well together and develop the, the ability to prioritize what they wanted to work on. Reflecting on our blended learning PLC, we came up with some things to think about. Um, timing out the work for each station prior to start, it, there were times when um, the work that we had was too long and so um, kids felt rushed and maybe needed more time. Um, and maybe moving from um, one station a day um, in social studies, giving them the full 55 minutes to do the station instead of having two stations at about 25 minutes. It was also helpful um, to have additional things for social studies students to move to if their pace is faster. So making sure that we have, um, uh, you know, next step enrichment work at each station. Um, and then how to make sure that the tasks are fitting within that station. Um, and having students create a station was one of the things that we wanted to get to in the um, spring, but obviously we didn't get there for, um, you know, obvious re reasons. Um, and then um, we did a survey in December, um, but we wanted to do a survey at the end of the year um, to help us perfect station rotation and what they would like to see.